and fix. So today we're doing a full day of eating as well as going to throw in a movie review on the new Guardians of the Galaxy movie. So this is how I start my day every single day. I love to have my shake. I look forward to it every day. Base, I usually do vanilla almond milk unsweetened, the organic version. Uh, you can use any type of milk you want. I just like almond milk. I, I try to stay away from dairy. Then this is my vegan protein that I like to use. Uh, I like vegan protein a little bit better than whey. It's a little healthier for you. Then I just get some oats. Honestly, whatever's on sale, as long as it says whole oats on it. I use two servings of that or one cup. You can use any type of fruit you want. Frozen just is a little easier for me. It lasts longer. Um, and then I get the organic version. Strawberry banana is kind of my favorite. With peanut butter, I use one and a half servings, but try to get a natural peanut butter. Doesn't necessarily have to be organic, but something that um, something that has one or two ingredients, three or four at max. Then I throw in just a little bit of honey, maybe half a serving of honey and cinnamon. Trust me. Uh, you put in uh, two uh, two teaspoons or a tablespoon of cinnamon. Makes everything taste great. Okay guys, so all done, this is what it looks like. What I forgot to say at the beginning was I always use uh, one serving or three ounces of kale and spinach and add water. So like for me, I don't really like really thick shakes. So I'll add water into it, water into it to kind of make it a little thinner consistency. But Honestly, by far my favorite thing to drink. Try it. it tastes phenomenal. Okay, so I just finished my shake and I'm gonna knock out my first workout. So I try to, instead of being in the gym for like two hours, I try to split up my workouts when I can in the morning and at night. So it just goes a little bit faster and I can focus on each muscle group. So about to knock out biceps and then head to the movies. So, knock that bicep workout. Pretty easy today. Um, I was looking for just something uh, quick, so I wasn't late for the movie, but still got a pretty good pump. Now, hopefully the hopefully the movie's good. I'm looking forward to it. The first one wasn't bad. I would say uh, I'd give the first the first Guardians of the Galaxy. I wasn't expecting much, so I, and I thought it was pretty good. I thought it was like an 8.5. So. I'm hoping that this one is as good or better, but I'll let you guys know. So, about to walk into the movie theater, uh, Park West 14. If you live in Cary, great movie theater to go to. And Tuesdays, they have a discount 
movie's like five dollars but about to check it out I'll let you know how it is Just finished watching the movie they definitely focused on on humor this one uh, I wasn't really wasn't that many fight scenes in it I thought the what they did with Groot was cute um, graphics were real good but uh, if you're a Marvel fan and you and you wanted any type of storyline uh, to be accurate or good in any way this this probably isn't it um but as, as long as you're not expecting much from the movie uh you don't really care about the storyline it's it's okay um i it's definitely not better than the first one 6.5 maybe a 7 i mean like i said uh, it was um it was a little long for me like i like longer movies but this one i, I kind of felt it was dragging and um so yeah, I'd say like 6.5. It, it's definitely funny. It has its moments, but it just it doesn't have enough fight scenes. It just it the whole ending is really predictable. It just it kind of falls a little short for me. So I was I wanted it just just a bit more, and it didn't have it. So I would say if you could watch it like get on like go on a Tuesday or or see the first showing when it's like a discount, it might be worth seeing. But if not, wait till it comes on cable. I mean. Hey guys, I would, so I'm about to eat lunch. So when I'm on, I usually eat fish. So this is just um, wild caught salmon. Make sure when you're eating fish, you want to look for something that says wild caught on it. I only had um, one serving of salmon, so I, I threw in a, another serving of of whiting as well. Then egg whites. This is easier for me. I'm lazy, so. Try to do it's a little bit easier. I do three servings of egg whites and then two servings of garlic toast. I would normally throw some broccoli in there as well, but ran out of broccoli, I gotta do shopping. And then the last thing, kombucha tea. If you haven't tried this before, try it. It's really good for you and it tastes really good. Good replacement for anything else, soda or like juice or anything else that you drink. Okay, so this is what it looks like. So this is two slices of toast. This is the salmon, the whiting, and the egg whites. And I put just um, half a serving, half a serving of ketchup on there. Okay, guys. So this is gonna be my snack. So it's gonna be another shake. So we're gonna do more of that pr vegan protein. I'm gonna actually use some PB Fit instead of peanut butter. Some Hershey's cacao. One Greek yogurt and water and that's pretty much it <laughs> so this shake is actually not too bad it doesn't taste as good as the first one but for like at work on my mini blender still pretty good okay so gonna knock out my second workout today it's gonna be chest and then uh Gonna have my last meal, and then we're done. Last meal, and I'm 
and post-workout meal. So at the end of the day, depending on how late I get home, I usually try to do the easiest thing for me. Sometimes that means eating breakfast for dinner. So tonight, I'm gonna do some protein pancakes, some chicken maple sausage from Applegate. I really like these guys. Um, three eggs. Got to the supermarket. Got my broccoli, and I'm about I'm gonna do a breast. Uh, I'm going to do like a, a, ch a grilled chicken breast as well and one serving of syrup. And then I'm going to finish off my gallon of water and drink some tea. Okay, so this is it. So this is um, two servings of the protein pancakes, one serving of the sausage, one half servings of the broccoli, uh, one chicken breast or like 126 grams, three eggs, and I put the syrup on yet and I'm just going to knock out the rest of this gallon of water. Uh, after I finish eating this, I'll let you know what my macros for the day were. Okay, so all done eating today. So what my macros finished at, so I had 3,400 calories, 247 grams of protein, 360 grams of carbs. Um, I had 41 grams of fiber, and I always try to get at least 40 grams of fiber. 190 grams, 109 grams of fat, and that's pretty much it. So... That's that's a day in the life for me. I usually eat a little bit more when I play when I play basketball because I burn some calories. Um, but 34 is 3400 is my goal normally. So if you have any questions, let me know. Please like, subscribe, comment, and share. Again, thank you for watching. Till next time, do what makes you happy. Chase your dreams. Let's get it. You ready to get fit?